Noelle dolls love to play house. How can you make a toy stroller, a playpen, and a changing table? Watch our new video to find out. LOL dolls are having fun. We jumped on the beds, had a pillow fight. Now it's time to play house. Yay, let's play. Use an old sponge. Outline an LOL Lil Sis doll. Remove part of the sponge and shape a bath support. Cut out small pieces of sponge to make ears of different colors. Glue them to the stand. Color the ornament with acrylic paint. Baby's ready to take a safe bath. <laughs> take some tool. Cut off a narrow strip. Fold it in half and pull a thread through it. Tighten the thread. Make a loop from a silver lace. Sew the loop to the tool. Here's a cute bathing sponge for a baby. All set for bath time. Come take your bubble bath. Add some warm water and lots of thick foam. We'll wash you with our new loofah and you'll be so clean. Take a pencil sharpener with the LOL logo. Clean it out. Take out the insides. Cut a square out of foil. Fold the foil so it fits the sharpener. Spread it along the walls. Let's take some tool. Cut off a small strip. Measure the diameter of the bottle and cut the fabric. Stitch the edges together. Turn it right side out. And apply hot glue. Make two different sized pockets. Put a bottle in the pocket. Fill up the refrigerator bag with nice stuff for a mom and her baby. LOL doll's on her way to a picnic. My friend's waiting. Here we are, what a great idea. A picnic in the forest. When it's this hot, you have to drink a lot of water. The baby's already hungry. Little ones, have some bananas. We have metallic cardstock. Cut a strip like this. Measure the LOL doll's height. Remove the extra length. Put double-sided tape on the edge of the cardboard. Join the edges together. Make two identical circles and connect them. Put the circles on the cardboard and outline them. Cut them out. Apply hot glue along the edges. Attach a cardboard ring. Put two pieces together. Draw a semicircle on the back of foam paper. Cut it out. Connect the edges with push pins. The double bassinet stroller is ready. Take little pizza tables and remove the extra length. Attach it to the base of the stroller. Use the wheels of a broken toy car. Take them out and heat the metal rod. Add the wheels to the bottom. Perfect fit. Take boucle fabric. Put two strips of metallic cardstock inside the beds. Cut out circles from the fabric and cover the bottom. Now your little ones will be warm and cozy. Cut some wire. Bend the edges. Apply hot glue. Make a handle and add it to the stroller. We'll take Sticky's toys and cut the suction pad. It's a neat little toy. We'll make a toy animal for each baby. The LOL kids are enjoying their new stroller. It's so cozy and so shiny. <laughs> Let's give a new life to a McDonald's cup. Take the lid off. Carefully cut off the bottom. Mark the height on foam paper. Draw a straight line. Cut. Press on strips of double-sided tape. Tape over the cup. We're making a pool. Here come the decorations. Use shells to decorate the sides of the pool. Put glue on top of the pool edge. Decorate with glitter. Wow! We'll make an umbrella out of a lid. Cut triangular parts from foam paper. Use double-sided tape and glue the foam paper to the lid. Cut out the ledges. Put in a straw. Remove the extra length. Put some hot glue on the bottom of a toy mushroom and put it on top of the straw. The beach umbrella for dolls is ready. The babies can play and splash in the pool under the shade of a colorful <laughs> umbrella. 
can enjoy the sun and watch them play at the same time. <laughs> Isn't this roll of paper too big for the poor LOL doll? <laughs> Unwrap the toilet paper, but leave the tube. Cut a small square out of cardboard. Bend it. Add double-sided tape and stick the edges together. This will be the basis for a little roll. Make the height on toilet paper. Draw a straight line and cut it out. Wrap a narrow strip of paper around a small tube. Use your potty, baby! And this toilet paper will come in handy. <laughs> cut out the extra parts of a plastic bottle. Leave the round middle part. Bend the plastic. Give it a square shape. Outline the edges. Cut out the middle part. Use corrugated cardboard to make a base for a playpen. Hot glue the plastic sides to the base. Cut a playpen net from white organza. Glue it to the sides. Round the edges of the cardboard and make the bottom for our playground. Take pink stickies toys and cut the suction cup. Attach four suction cups to the edges of the playpen base. Decorate the base joints of the playpen with foam paper tape. Decorate the edges of the side with webbing. Cut a square out of microfiber fabric. Put it on the bottom of the playpen. Now you can play with your favorite toys all day. Use plastic curtain hooks. Remove the extra parts. Take a flat copper braid about this long. Bend the edges. Hot glue the hook. Add the second one. Cover the wire with acrylic paint. Cut plastic circles of the same size from a dense paper folder. Draw wheels with a permanent marker. Stick the wheels to the base of the hook. Then secure them. Look at them go! Cut foam paper according to the outline. Hot glue the edges together. Let's attach the seat to the stroller. Cut a bumper from foam paper. Decorate it with glittery stars. Decorate the sides with foam paper. Cut a circle from organza. Heat the edges. Stitch along the edges. Tighten the thread. Cut two parts from foam paper. Glue them to the organza. Decorate with beads on fishing line. Can't wait to take a walk. Luckily, I have a mosquito net. Now my baby will feel safe. <laughs> Mark the outlines of a changing table on corrugated cardboard. Draw strips of equal width. Cut it. Mark the length. Glue two strips together. Glue them to the edge of the square base. Put smaller strips on the opposite side. Use flat copper braid. Bend the edges. Make four identical pieces. Cut thin straws in half. Apply hot glue to the edge of the wire and put it on a straw. Use a needle to make a hole in the center of the straw. Do the same on both sides. Put a thread through the holes. Connect the parts. Paint the legs with acrylic paint. Place them in the cardboard cuts. Attach cardboard pieces on one side. Take a synthetic wipe to clean it up. Cut a piece about this big. Bend the edge. Add hot glue. Now we have soft sides. Put glue on the cardboard base and secure the surface of the table. Cut a strip of foam paper. Put glue on the outside edges of the table and cover the attachment points with foam paper. The folding changing table is ready. <laughs> we'll change your diaper quickly, my sweet baby. With a comfy changing table like this, it'll be really fast. Which idea did you enjoy the most? A stroller, a pool, a beach umbrella, or refrigerator bag? Like this video, subscribe to Lalalu, and click the bell so you don't miss any of our new videos.